Yeah, the Supreme Court has been bitten by the AI bug. The court has invited bids for design, development and implementation of artificial intelligence-based solutions, including tools for transcribing orders and court proceedings. Ashma joins us now with more. Ashma, take us to the court's plan of action when it comes to AI. Well, the Supreme Court clearly is wishing to onboard the AI bus and towards that end, uh, we understand, has uh, issued an RFP, a request for proposal, and has invited bids uh, uh, for a lot of uh, tech players who can provide it with an AI-enabled system. So what exactly is it that the Apex Court is looking for? Well, uh, the COVID pandemic that we saw brought in the wave of virtual hearings uh, that has, in fact, become mainstream now between various courts. Now, what the Apex Court is looking at is an AI-enabled tool that will document and display conversations that they are happening almost in real time. And this is the need for which an AI tool is sought. Uh, this will enable uh, for conversations that take place in a courtroom, whether that's exchange of arguments, whether that's observations made by the courtroom, whether that's orders being pronounced in open court. Subject to a review, this is of course very uh, initial uh, at this point, subject to a review, these details can then be put out on the website, can also be put out on uh, various handles of the Apex Court. And that is essentially what the Apex Court is looking at. The Supreme Court believes that such AI-enabled tools, and this, of course, uh, coming under the leadership of the E-Committee, which is headed by the none other than the Chief Justice himself, this direction that the uh, Chief is looking to give uh, the AI tool is to enable better access uh, to these judicial pr uh, proceedings for the public. So uh, AI uh, is clearly the theme here. The CJI, Chief Justice Chandrachur, looking to onboard and looking to develop these tools uh, to enable better access uh, to these judicial forums uh, to the public. All right, Ashwit, many thanks for joining us. Now, Golden Boy Neera.